Have you ever wondered why there's such a cloud of mystery and misconception around the herpes virus? Beginning with an introduction to the herpes simplex virus, we'll uncover its history and biological makeup. This virus has two main types, HSV-1, often associated with cold sores, and HSV-2, typically linked to genital herpes. Despite these associations, there are shades of gray between the two. Moving on to the differences between HSV-1 and HSV-2, we'll delve into their unique characteristics, similarities, and the crossover zones. While they may have different reputations, both types share a lot in common, making them tricky to distinguish at times. Next is the symptom spotlight, revealing the wide range of manifestations. From the common cold sore to less common, yet severe complications, the symptoms of herpes can be as diverse as the people it affects. The tale of transmission is another intriguing aspect. The stealthy nature of herpes and the challenge of preventing its transmission make it a persistent public health issue. The virus can spread even in the absence of symptoms, adding a layer of complexity to its containment. Living with herpes is not just about managing physical symptoms. The psychological impact and social stigma can often be more challenging to navigate. It's time to debunk those myths and bring the truth to light. As we explore the treatment trajectory, we'll discuss antiviral therapies, their effectiveness, and the exciting frontier of ongoing research into potential cures. While there's currently no cure for herpes, modern medicine provides tools to manage and significantly reduce its impact. The quest for a herpes vaccine is a thrilling journey. We'll share the latest updates on the efforts to develop a vaccine and what the future might hold. Prevention and protection strategies play a crucial role in mitigating transmission risks. Public health initiatives are pivotal in educating people about herpes, dispelling myths, and promoting safe practices. Personal narratives from individuals living with HSV-1 or HSV-2 will offer unique insights. These stories serve as both cautionary tales and messages of hope, demonstrating that a herpes diagnosis doesn't dictate one's life. Finally, we'll hear expert insights from dermatologists, virologists, and sexual health experts. They'll shed light on the current state and future prospects of herpes research and societal understanding. By the end of this journey, you'll have a clear and factual understanding of the herpes simplex virus. This knowledge will empower you to make informed health decisions and contribute to a more informed, empathetic conversation about this widespread virus.